Kenobi movie edits aren't new, but this fan edit takes it to a whole new level. What you are seeing are comparisons of original shots from the series to newly edited shots added in by the editor himself. This isn't just cutting down footage into a two hour film. This edit includes new shots, VFX changes, lighting edits, alterations to fit canon correctly, reshoots, and so much more. The VFX here just looks studio level quality. So how is this even possible? Well, the person working on it, Pixel Joker 95, has reportedly worked on official Star Wars shows in the past, as he was a VFX artist for Andor season one. So he's already a professional in the industry. And here are a few of the biggest changes seen. First is the Fortress Inquisitorus, where the fan edit shows it much more like its Jedi Fallen Order counterpart. Next is the Grand Inquisitor, Inquisitor looking more like his rebel counterpart, and the final fight between Obi-Wan Kenobi and Darth Vader, having more destruction going on in the background, almost giving a blue version vibe of the Mustafar battle. Pixel Joker 95 also gave us a behind the scenes look of the additional reshoots, with him mentioning that he'll be utilizing deepfakes, just like Disney, to ensure Kenobi looks like Kenobi. It's estimated the fan edit will be released for Star Wars Celebration or May 4th, but it's not confirmed, but after 8-12 to 12 months in the making, only time will tell. If you're interested in watching the full trailer of the fan edit, it will be appearing on the end screen now.